friends, it's Nancy. I know I have been pretty quiet recently, but I've been in the process of moving my craft studio <laughs> upstairs to this um, spare bedroom. Um, and that was sort of the point of my daughter-in-law coming to visit for Easter. Um, she was going to help me get moved and organized and sorted and labeled, and she's really good at that kind of stuff. But... Um, situation being what it is, uh, no travel, so she has rebooked her flights for Labor Day. Hopefully, um, we'll be able to be back on the road and shopping and carrying on like fools. Anyway, so I just thought I'd give you a quick little tour. Um, so this furniture, this... I, can't, I don't think I can get back any further. So there's a... That's my briefcase. I've got my my files in there. Um, this three piece set of um, I don't know what you'd call it. Um, it's kind of a bookshelfy kind of deal, but this is actually this pulls down, so it's a bar. It has a mirror in the back, and there's drawers. Um, so nothing's organized. <laughs> Uh, we had this desk down in the basement in the cold cellar, so I dragged that up last night and cleaned it up and um, scrubbed it down and installed it here. The problem with it being a glass top was it banged against the wall, so what I did was I just went and got one of those pool noodles at the dollar store and put a slit in it and now it doesn't make any noise at all. Now you're probably wondering, <laughs> two laptops? Well, that's because I'm working from home now. I am a telecommuter for the foreseeable future. Um, I was able to get some work done today, um, early this morning, but then our system kind of went kerplooey because we don't actually have the technological ability to um, have as many people online on our internal, I don't know, whatever. I'm sure somebody much smarter than me would be able to explain it. All I know is I can't use it. So, um, I went to work this morning. It's just a tiny little thing. And at work we have them docked into these docking stations. And then we have huge double monitors on our desks. Um, so I had to go to the office and get a keyboard and a mouse because the the laptop itself is so tiny that my man hands are <laughs> just pounding on the keys. <laughs> uh, the other laptop is my personal laptop. So I'm hoping I can do some crafting tonight. Got my tea ready. Um, last night, my son and I went out and we, I'm in my nightgown, woo -woo! Um, we went out and bought this new smart TV, so it's already got Roku, um, and I've been binge watching BritBox, um, watching a show about, uh, the London hospital in the early 1900s or something like that. Um... So I would, what I am going to be doing is these boxes here with the lids. I already have a whole bunch of these downstairs that I've sorted my supplies into um, categories. So I'll be bringing those up here and I think I can fit probably 15 in there. Um, actually some of the things I'm looking at and I'm thinking I am never going to do, uh, an entire journey journal about Hawaii. <laughs> so I might be discarding some of those things. Uh, the one I've got up here while I was cleaning stuff out, I found I had quite a bit of Holly Hobby. So that's, that's that box. Um, up here, I will be able to put some more kind of decorative stuff. Um, so I made this little jar here. Um, it's full of buttons and it's got a doily and I painted the, the metal um, jar ring. <laughs> Um, and I got this plastic box on the weekend. It has little feet. 
And um, right now I've just got a bunch of uh, um, wrinkly seam binding. So I will have, uh, I'll be able to put some more decorative stuff up here. Um, uh, this is a slim down version of books. So um, there's books that I want to use pages from. There's books I want to use covers from. There's books I want to use images from. So I've kind of got them sorted that way. Um, but ultimately this will be sort of my mailing station for, uh, orders. So I've got my, um, scale, my mailing scale and my printer. Um, and my daughter-in-law who is adorable, she sent me as an early mother's day gift, this label writer. Um, so I have yet to get that unpacked. We talked last night. She says, it's just a plug and play. You just have to take it out of the box. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we're going to give that a shot. Um, here, I got this cart at um, Ikea. So it's uh, on wheels. And I thought, this is perfect to keep my sewing machine on. And then I can just drag my sewing machine over here. And then when I'm... Working on projects, I can just craft, 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 turn, stitch, craft, 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 turn, and stitch. Um, here on this wall, it doesn't look very big, but it, that um, picture frame is huge. And um, I intend to um, actually mount it on the wall higher, like sort of the top of that, that door frame, or sorry, the top of the door because it does go quite low underneath where the top of the sewing machine is. Um, so this sewing machine, I did have a different tabletop on it. Um, I've taken the tabletop off and I'm going to find something else. The piece of wood that's on it right now is just a, a slab of wood that was in as a shelf um, in the cabinet underneath the, the television. So I've just got it there. Um, I have a piece of gray and white marble that I might put on top there. Um, yeah. So that's to come in days. You can see I've got lots of stuff I still need to sort. Uh, I actually went through this room and I sorted out five boxes of stuff that I dumped on Natalie's front door yesterday. So Natalie is um, somebody I haven't actually met yet. Uh, I met her husband last night, <laughs> but uh, Natalie lives locally. And I just, I didn't realize that there was anybody local until she ordered from me. And I went, oh, oh, I know, I know where that street is. So um, hopefully when all this uh, uh, social isolation ends maybe we can get together and uh, maybe do some crafting or something so I felt sort of badly about dumping all that stuff on her porch but she was cheerful about it um didn't seem overly annoyed <laughs> um but there was just I don't I don't know what her style is so I didn't know what she'd like or not like and it was all you know junk journal stuff Anyway, so that's what I've been up to. Um, so far, this isolation thing has been going good for me. Um, don't have to wear pants. Don't have to put on a bra. Don't have to go anywhere. Because it's, it's good. It's patriotic. <laughs> to stay home. So, where you see this empty space, I'm going to be dragging up some craft supplies and uh, taking advantage of some of this late day sun to get some stuff done. So, thanks so much for checking in on me. I hope everybody's well. Um, take care. We'll talk again soon.